Is everyone enjoying their sandwiches? Yes. <laughs> Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, I don't often uh, record footage of myself, but uh, I'm Kevin with the, Hap uh, the Papano Homes Project. Uh, I don't know if you can see me behind me there is uh, John off in the distance working in our uh, skid steer loader to try to correct some, um, some grading and some uh, where the ground has kind of started to, to sink around a, a culvert um, on the way up the driveway to the property. Um, so yeah, we got our skid steer delivered today. Got a bunch of photos of that and some video of it being dropped off. Very exciting stuff. Um, there's a lot of work to be done uh, on the driveway here, uh, but also around the exterior of uh, the dwelling that we call the shoe, uh, where uh, uh, Bernice and Alan have moved in with their kids. Um, so yeah, me and Emily, we're here for two weeks. Um, we're about four days into our uh, two week stay where we're going to be helping out around the property with whatever we can. Everything from helping to get printers set up to helping to get stuff cleared out of the garage to setting up a heat pump, hopefully. Lots of exciting stuff. This is pretty awesome. So we're having our skid steer delivered to the property. Here we go. Offloading the skid steer off the truck. It's a beautiful thing. So, one of the first things that we're working on up at the shoe is uh, doing a little bit of wall repair. Um, the corners of this room didn't quite have a uh, finishing uh, touches in the corners and some gaps and things like that. So we're mudding them in. It's John who's been doing that. And uh, yeah, after we do that, we're going to uh, hit the walls with some uh, uh, anti-mold uh, primer. There's some issues, I don't know if you can kind of see it on the bottom of the wall there by the trim in the closet right there. So, uh, if you hear a little bit of that, that sort of background noise in this recording, it's because we have a dehumidifier running. We try to keep this room dry while we're uh, waiting for the time to dry. Do you want to give us a quick uh, rundown of what's going on in this room? Oh, lots is going on in this room. Yep. Um, rundown. Let's see, we just got water system installed, mm -hmm. uh, but the water system doesn't have an independent, I guess, receptacle, which is kind of using with the, uh, it's going to have a washing machine here, so what we're going to have to do is, uh, I'm installing receptacle gear, so we can plug the uh, the UV lights and I guess the, uh, the, the iron clear thing um, together on there independently, and then you can have the washing machine um, hooked up here. Uh, dryer vent is going in as well. Um, it's connected right outside. We just got to connect it to the bad boy when it comes in. And the water system, well, we have piping that's going into the what we call the smoking room. Um, but that is capped off on that side, but it actually is not not well done. So it doesn't have like a frost-free one. So we're a little concerned that's going to like freeze during the winter. So we're going to cap that out from outside. Um, and I have a frost-free... Uh, just one of these uh, sharp bite fittings, which is really super easy to use. Um, so I'll plug in this bad boy over here and then redirect the water for the washing machine. Then we have the receptacle for the dryer here that I'm working on right now, and well, there you go. All that stuff all happening at once. All that, eh? <laughs> Please press the like button if you think we've earned it. Subscribe to the channel for updates as we continue our journey.